I got up this morning when it was like very dark. Dark, dark, dark. Maybe you need to get put to bed later. You think that would solve the problem? Yeah, I mean, I think if you go to sleep at 7.30, you're gonna wake up pretty early. Huh. Uh, uh. Let's chill. Let's just chill, watch some TV. I'm yeah, we're, film it. we're coming in a little frazzled. We always plan to kind of start this around like 9.30, but you guys know how it goes. Sometimes morning routines don't always go as planned. Are we on episode 21? I think it's t t episode 20. We're back to, we're uh, on this one? No, like, it's actually episode 20, but it but, says episode 21. But we're watching episode 21 on the screen? Yeah. But it's 20 for you guys. I don't know. The links that MTV gave us expired or something, so we're watching this on Amazon, but it feels like we're near the end of season five. Yes. Let's see what they say. I'm sure they'll say on this season, on this yeah, season finale of Channel News. I got a haircut mm -hmm. this morning. Looks good. Very fresh. Ready for your tournament. Are you? Merch, me pushing a dolly. <laughs> Check it out. That's the end of channel news. I don't know if you guys can hear the construction sounds. <laughs> you also left the TV on all night. <laughs> it won't turn off, it's frozen. Oh no. Instagram isn't working. Previously on. Yes. Spencer was worried Heidi was keeping a secret. What if she's pregnant? Game over. And Brody was having his ups and downs with Jade. I will go jump off a building if I have to argue with you one more time. Why don't you Three. just listen for once so in your whole entire life? Justin finally told Audrina he had moved on. Kristen did something different to me than you. Whoa. And then he and I had an amazing time in Vegas. Hey, Philip. Actually, not no, as bad as I should. It's because I'm here. So what happens now? When we go back to the real world. <laughs> But now that we were back in LA, I wasn't sure my gamble on Justin was gonna pay off. I can't believe summer's over. Ugh, I don't know, I don't wanna- It's like, get out of my house. <laughs> you know, Justin should really help you pack. Yeah, and where's he gonna put all the boxes? On his motorcycle? Burn. Justin. Oh man, what are you gonna do about that? Um, I don't think I'm gonna do anything about that. I mean, Vegas was a lot of fun and Everything was pretty much perfect, but it's never gonna be like that. Like, vacation is never the way it's really gonna be. Do you still like him? Yeah, I do. And it's hard after Vegas not to like him. I mean, he went all the way to Vegas for you. I know. I've never seen you with any guy have as much fun as you guys were in Vegas. I've just been- You've known me for six weeks. I've been really hurt before, and I think that I would get hurt with Justin. Yeah, but if you don't risk being in a relationship, then you're probably gonna end up alone. I don't know, I mean... But I think that you should give Justin a chance. I don't know what I want to do, to be honest. I really don't. Uh, that's where the theme song would come in. We don't have this theme song. Staring at the, the blank page before you Open up the dirty window Let the sun the wind the words that you cannot find Reach it for something in the distance Some clothes you can almost taste it Release your inhibitions, be the way on your whole skin. No one knows, I haven't done this in so long. No one knows it's gonna be for you. Only you can let it in. It's the worst key of all time. No one else, no one else can speak the words on your own lips. Live your life with words and talk in me. Today is where your book begins. The rest is still unwritten. Yeah. Nice. Do we have the theme song? This episode is called The Boys of Summer. Summer's ending is what I gathered. She's packing up her Malibu house. Yeah. Back to reality. She's got to make some big decisions. Spencer and Brody just 
shooting hoops in the backyard. There's a chance that uh, I'm about to really be Pratt Daddy, for real. Heidi's been talking about this baby for so long, you know, blah, 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 blah. And Charlie's like, you better watch out. She's going to try to get pregnant on the DL. Guess what I find in the trash that night? Pregnancy test. Aren't you supposed to discuss these sort of things in a marriage? We did. She said, I'm having a baby, and... And that's it? And that's it. That's not a discussion. That's called a... I don't know what that's called. No, you don't. I don't know how to add a lot of sentences you start, buddy. Straight hijacking sperm. I mean, that's that's scary. All right, so... so hair again is in a bad Jane's thing. trying to take our relationship to the next level. <laughs> you know, it starts with moving in, and then you're engaged, and then you're married, and then Jane's pregnant. I bet you money. Not only are you engaged this time next year, but she's talking about babies. Let me just say something. If Jane starts pressuring me to do anything I don't want to do, then that's it. We're broken up. That's uh, it. Okay. I'm going to kill her. <laughs> oh, no. Mm, maybe flip-flops are the best choice for shooting her. <laughs> maybe flip-flops are never the best choice. Ever. They're, re life. they're really never the best choice. Never wear flip-flops in my life. People are going to get very triggered by that. I have some good... We've talked about this. lovers out there. <laughs> I don't know if we've talked about flip-flops on this channel or but we've talked about the flip flops. We've talked about not wearing flip flops on the plane and let me just take it one That's step further. That's a huge no no. Don't ever wear flip flops anywhere. <laughs> ever. You can't go that far but I just did. To each their own. Nope. I'm a most to everyone no, else Sam. mine. Everyone has to do what I say. Sonny went into my our bathroom <sighs> and he turned on the tushy which is a bidet attachment. T-U-S-H-Y. Full blast and did not put his anus in the way of it like you're supposed to and tushied the whole medicine cabinet ceiling it's for probably straight two over. straight minutes. It's straight all over. I, my yeah. whole makeup bag was just had like droplets of water. I'm like, this is from the toilet? It is. It's yeah, okay. so you have toilet press. water on your on your face makeup. Catherine Mel Melandrino Salon. Okay, the girls are getting their hair done. No, this is a shop. Catherine Melandrino is a clothing line. This is a shop that used to have like a little cafe in the front that they would film at all the time. Maybe you can get like a long sleeve cute dress, like a mini with long sleeves. Yeah. That really? would be cute. Ooh, so so cute. cute. So I have to tell you, I called Justin. Because last time I saw him, I was just kind of stunned and overwhelmed, and I couldn't get anything out. Oh my but God. It's over, he literally so told you so me. many I know, things. But I feel like I have to meet him one last time. Are they no, in an alter no, no. alternate universe? This is so whack. It's like they're trying to get the show canceled. They're like, I know how we'll get it canceled. We'll just do the same scene like over and over and over and again. I should have Adriana on the podcast and ask her like. Conversation. This time I know what I'm doing going into this. I'm gonna say what I have to say first, and that's it. And look really hot. Yeah, I'm gonna wear this hat. <laughs> what are these red drinks with no ice? A button down shirt. <laughs> oh, there's ice. Cranberry vodka. That was such a thing. What's up with the place? You getting out of here? Yeah. Can't believe it's over, though. I'm gonna miss this house. Are you? Yeah, we had so much fun here. Good times, huh? <laughs> yeah. I hate Justin. I know. So he has such a bad attitude. He, he, this is what he does. I mean, we can even have a little montage of this. Is your place spick and span? <laughs> it's very clean, yeah. Is it? Why spend any second of your life to have that unsettling, ulcery feeling for nothing? You. Did you tell me? He just, he just asks. It's like that. It's like that scene in Forty Year Old Virgin where they're like, you should just ask questions and like be kind of a dick. We have a great um, section of do it yourself. Do you like to do it yourself? That's what he does. Uh -huh. She's like, yeah, I'm like really sad to get out of here. He's like, are you? <laughs> Good and bad. There you go. <laughs> well. If you ever have trouble finding a place, you can always come see my spot. You can come see I it. I mean, it's hard. I mean, there's a lot of people in this world, and to find somebody that is compatible with you, you for you, and by you, I have that attraction with you. For I have that you feeling by towards you. you. Uh, she does not. I don't know. I mean, a big part of me wants to be with you and give it a shot, but no I feel like 
we should probably just kind of break up. Cool off a little bit. Yeah. I mean, Vegas was so fun. It was perfect. <sighs> but it's also a lot easier there because no one else is around and it's not the real world. All right, well. I just don't want to be serious with anybody. I don't want a, a boyfriend. Mm. You're dumped, dog. Yeah, you're For dumped. That same tune out of your, out of your mouth since the, the beginning. I feel like I'm here. I haven't flaked anymore. I went to Vegas because you called me. So <sighs> you need to figure it out. No, 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 Justin. She just did. Yeah, dog. <laughs> she told you. Dude, I'm taking this drink. Take my glass of blood. I'm giving you one more chance. Yeah, you need to figure it out. <laughs> I'll be inside. She's like, no, mother Like, we have to move out, okay? Get on your motorcycle and go back to your spot that I don't ever want to see. <laughs> the show's over. We're over. <laughs> I'll let you take a shower in my bathroom in Vegas. That's all that happens. Like Hollywood? Mm-hmm. Like Hollywood's cool. Mm-hmm. Woohoo! Yeah, baby! Yeah, baby! Oh my gosh. Hey, Whoa. guys. Hey. Starting to dress, dress like Charlie, bro. I'm just beating Enzo in a race, you know? Enzo, yeah. who's winning? Spencer. Uh, <laughs> is this all you guys have been doing today? Yeah, we're just having a, you know, honest relationship. Oh, that's nice. What? Was that passive aggressive? <laughs> Enzo, are you going to get married someday? Yeah, someday. Are you gonna have a baby when you're married? Only if you're a grown-up. Am I a grown-up, Enzo? I don't know. Heidi, while you're at the grocery store, you stop by the uh, pharmacy, get anything? Did you need something at the pharmacy? Oh, I thought you needed something at the pharmacy. No, I did not need anything at the pharmacy. Is there a reason you're asking me this? Are you guys fighting? Why would you think that? Does it seem like that, Enzo? You're acting like a weirdo. If you have something you want to ask me, then ask me. Nope. Mamma mia! Mamma mia! <laughs> so annoying. <laughs> Debating whether to finish this or not. Really? Yeah. Because it's that it's that frustrating to watch. Well, I think it's not fun. I think like people don't want to watch these episodes anymore. Mm -hmm. I think they still like our reaction videos, but like. It's, it's less likable when you don't like the show. Yeah, 100%. So I am debating what to do. I want to finish it because I want to have like a complete thing. Why don't you have a vote? Why don't we ask, why don't we do a vote on the community tab? Go vote. All right, where are we? Taylor's, Taylor's engagement, engagement party. party. Taylor's engagement. Sleazy T is engaged. Look at him. And are they at Linda's house? Looks like it. And is it one of Jade's playmate friends that he's engaged to? Let's see. And are they still married? I don't know. This is Sleazy T graduating <laughs> to, Taylor. to Taylor. To Taylor. Oh. This is oh. uh, uh, you have, you have knighted party. me that. Glad we can all come together. Cheers, cheers. I wish you all the best. Thank you. What? It's a Oh my Who's god, there? grass and high heel right, shoes do not. Two, uh, I right. know. Well, cheers. Congratulations. Happy. I'm very happy for the both of you guys. Hopefully, <laughs> you guys will be next. <laughs> no, we're it's about that currently time. broken I know, up. Right? I feel like if you guys are engaged, like, we should at least live together. And maybe this will put a little bit of pressure on Brody. <laughs> and we have the vocal fry. Yeah, Is that an all time fing <laughs> high with these two? <laughs> so alive. Oh my we'll lord. See. Uh, so you're full on back together, yeah. you two. Well, what happened? What do you mean, what happened? What? Why is f***ing Brody in a t-shirt and Sleazy T is in a top? Yeah, this is you. not making sense. Maybe it's time for that next step. They're all in different uh, wardrobes. I hate well, it. it. Some of your brother Taylor. Where did Frankie get those slacks? <laughs> First of all, don't be retarded. I'm 100% not ready to get married. I have the rest of my life to... <laughs> Frankie's like, why did you just, why'd you call me retarded? Like, that was way out of line. Frankie's taken so much abuse. Yeah, really. Montage, Frankie getting abused. Oh, God. Um, I guess God, it's kind of lame here, so I don't know. Not really, it's kind of fun, but whatever. Oh, call me back, bye. Happy 27th. Happy first birthday. Hey, by the way, where's Audrina? Wasn't she supposed to be here? 
Whatever. Even I'm sick of out. talking about it. Don't take that off, bro. Bro, it's so hot in here. No, that's our costume, bro. You don't sit down and relax and just have a chill. But right now, in my 20s, no. Nah. Oh, hey, boy oh. talk. I think it's time for us to sit down. And... Let's do this. Let's get everybody rounded up. All right, you guys. It's Sleazy, T I mean, Taylor's dinner. Cool, Rody. We'll probably get a ding for this song, but. This was the Paris Hilton phase, too, and like, it's hot, it's and like hot. that whole thing, and so a lot of people were, like, didn't Talking realize what off. they were mimicking. Uh -huh. Yeah. I told Justin we're done. What? Yeah, so. Leave it, Stacy, all right? Also, get out! It's just not worth it. I mean, I am really scared of getting hurt. It's really I really am. Yeah. That's why I haven't had a boyfriend for two years. Really? Yeah. So scared of being hurt. I think it's because my parents are divorced. Like I really don't want to get a divorce and make my kids go through what my so, brother. Really, it's, it awful. Really sad. it's so awful. I don't know. I think that's why I just can't really get that close to guys. I think that they're gonna screw me over or something. I feel like you not like you put up a front, but you're just you're very tough. I mean on the outside, you know, but I definitely get hurt. Trust just takes time though too. It's like, I don't know. I think when it's like a good person, you know, you'll just kind of It'll work. Yeah. Yeah, it's nice. To many, many oh, years of, of happiness to both of you guys. Oh, oh, Cheers. We caught the end of it, thank God. Let's eat. Let's eat. I'm oh. hungry. Talk about how cute Taylor and Abby are right now. Well, you guys were all cute. Yes, they're so cute. Oh, my God. He's got a matching tattoo. Uh, br to Brody? Yes. Oh. Look. Oh. B for Brody. Doesn't look like a B on his arm, mm -hmm. but. Yeah. It's weird how they've been secrets. together for like secrets two months out. and they're engaged and we've been dating for like a year and a half and. Yeah, well, we're <laughs> smart. I'm not saying that we should get engaged. I just feel like we should do something. Something, yeah. <laughs> I'm like, what? You should get a lease on a house and Boko fry together there. <laughs> <laughs> You're starting to sound so crazy. You can go forever. <laughs> it's like my breath never runs out when I'm doing Boko fry. Yeah. Like you're not you're happy with our relationship. I'm happy. I just feel like you. I'm not happy with it. Commitment. Oh, yeah. I'd rather kill myself. Yeah, I'd rather. Having this conversation, I've told you that three times. Like, I'd literally rather jump off the top. I think it's a little scary that we just got back together and we're already talking about moving in together. I mean, you are the one that was a jerk. I've forgiven you, so it's like you should be happy that I'm even talking to you about this right now. Congratulations. Really? Realistically, yes, really. A lot of But you don't want to live together? I just don't really want to talk about it. I feel like we're at Taylor and Abby's engagement party and that this is not a time for us to have a conversation like this. I think it's a little scary. Wow, so sorry. Not sorry. Mm -hmm. I love I can hear you guys. <laughs> run, Brody, run. Oh, yeah, seriously. But also, Jade, like. Run, Jade, run. Adrina, where is she? Meeting JB. Meet me by the ocean. She doesn't seem dressed appropriately. Mm -mm. The scene has happened so many times. How are you doing? Good, how are you? Why are we here? I'm not here to fight with you. Oh. I just, the last time we talked, he said a lot of things and... I never meant to hurt you. I never meant for anybody to get hurt. I don't know, a year ago, I never would have imagined we would come to this. I just... I don't feel like These I... are called French overs when you shoot like this and you're shooting like oh, from right. behind. You'll notice in Siesta Key, they only shoot like that. I don't feel Ooh. like I can even be mm, friends with cool. you. Ooh, yeah, I don't think you guys can be friends either. But that's a smart boundary. I don't know. 
I just feel like this is going to be the last conversation we ever Even have. if it's the last conversation and you want to be young about it, then be young about it. you got to remember, you're the one who said, get out of my life. And so you didn't I, get out of my life. I definitely tried. You're I've so selfish. You're selfish. You're self-centered. All you care about is yourself. I wish you'd see, like, why wouldn't Justin be committed? Or maybe you just weren't the one. Or maybe I didn't want to put you through hurt. But you did put me through hurt for all those years that you, you know, played with my emotions you know what's funny? and just kept it wasn't going even, in circles it, we would, and We wouldn't over. see each other for four or five months at a time, so what are you talking about? And then we'd hang out once, and you'd be like, well, what are oh, we? Oh, we'd hang out once. See, you go around telling people that we were never together, nothing. We weren't, Audrina. Oof. You're going to be incapable of loving someone. You're, it's like you're missing out on life. You're going to grow to be a lonely old man. <laughs> you know what? I hope you do fall in love someday, because then maybe you'll actually feel something. I wish you the best, Justin. They're both just like so confused too, I think about what really happened. Right. Like there's been so many people involved in their relationship and producers telling them things like, I think to us, we're like, Audrina, just get with the picture. Like, right. but I think that she's been told, who knows what she's been told he thinks or whatever, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, I mean, I think I think Audrina is, is there, like, they sent Audrina in there being like, okay, we're going to do a scene where you finally break up with Justin, mm -hmm. your boyfriend of mm -hmm. four years. Mm -hmm. That's the way it's been on the show. Like, it needs to feel like that. Mm -hmm. And Justin is like, I think what he said was probably true. Like, we don't see each other for four or five months. You date Corey, you yeah. date whoever. You're probably dating Corey right now. Yeah. Like, d d don't make me out to be the be guy the who guy. wasn't there for you because mm -hmm. we weren't really together. Yeah. And Audrina's like, no. Yeah, 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 yeah. And he's yeah, like, yeah, I don't yeah. want to do this because right. I'm and the I, bad guy. Right, right, right. I really don't dislike Justin Bobby. Like, I don't. I just, he got, he let himself get produced into this corner. Yeah. I mean, and I don't know how he was edited with Kristen, but he definitely didn't have the best game with her about it. That I think he really liked Kristen. Yeah, I do and too. And wasn't aware that Kristen was doing, playing, playing his role. Mm -hmm. in, the, the role that he played with Audrina. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Meanwhile, these two are in just a completely in a community theater play that I did not buy a ticket for. <laughs> it's true. What do you, uh, what do you Literally, want to on about? a set in someone else's um, home. I found a pregnancy test in our trash when I was taking out the trash. Okay. Okay. Are you pregnant? I was hoping, but it looks like your wishes came true, and I'm not. How did our marriage get to this point? You just said you never want kids and just shut down that whole idea. You know, I've really been thinking about it, and you know, I used to say all my life since we were 16, I'm never getting married. I'm 100% not getting married. So the 100% uh, I'm not having a baby talk, I'm not sure how much juice that really has so when we're both ready we will have a baby i mean that's a big thing to hear that's a big it's a real it's a big end to this fake story on. <laughs> it's a big change you know i need to be about whatever my wife's about you know whatever you want to do and i'm right there with you great great cool 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 what are you guys gonna fight about next Huge sigh of relief. Brody Clown's condo. Yeah, yeah. We should pack up her stuff and like move him in and stuff. I know you guys have been telling me for a while to break oh. up with Jade and. What do you think about tying your hoodie tie like that? That's Never kinda, seen it. That's kind of crazy. I'm into it. <laughs> I've been very up in the air. Uh, Lizzy T. Who said you could wear that hat? Like, <laughs> Both their looks. Don't know <laughs> who, you, who said you could wear that hat? If I should do it, if I shouldn't. And after your engagement party, and she tried to pressure me to move in and mm. take the next step. I think that that was way too early and I think I'm done with it. Oof. What? <laughs> what? Yeah! yeah. Bring it like that, <laughs> we get on that way again! Yeah! Relax, just relax. Yes. Yes. I, mean, I think that's for the best. 
go to the I just, I kind of open my eyes, because I feel like when you're in a relationship, sometimes like, you don't even realize what else is out there until you step back from it. And, and there's all a lot of a sudden... Of, there's a lot of options for you. Welcome to the good It's been uh, so long since I've been single. Jeez. Literally, it went straight from Cora to Jade. It's actually, it, it went, went pretty, Olivia. It went pretty quick. You have to Jade. break up with her now. No, it went, no, it went no. Olivia, yeah, like, Cora, like, Olivia, no, Cora and Jade. It was Brittany, and then Olivia, and then there was that other one. You forgot about Kelly. Oh, yeah. It's weird for me to say this, but weird. I still think I may have feelings for Kristen, maybe. Stop, wow. stop, stop, dog, stop. Good. Good? I think she's good for you. Oh my god, if Stacy's there, I'm gonna freak out. <laughs> Someone's gotta help her, and who else is it gonna it be? It needs to be someone else. Oh my god. I get it. I get it. Like, this is bad. Like, you don't wanna keep seeing the same scenes with the same people. Mm -hmm. Hi. He's like, didn't I dump you three seconds ago? Yeah. It's getting bare in here. Can you believe I'm moving out? Yeah, it's good. So, what's up? Just ride around. Thinking. Yeah? Thinking about what? You and I? Should we talk? You want to go sit outside? Yeah. What? So what's up? You were to get dumped again? I left. Mm. I didn't like it. I didn't like that feeling. It made me realize I can't, for some reason, let this go. My big issue is obviously commitment. I know to run. Yeah. What's funny is, you know, my last conversation with Adrienne, she told me I was gonna end up a lonely old man. <laughs> I don't go after basically what I believe in. And I believe in this, you know? Oh my goodness. I wanna have fun with you. I wanna do things with you. I wanna laugh with you. <laughs> like that. <laughs> I think we're very capable of having a lot of fun together and laughing a lot together. You know, when it's like this, it's great. I mean, I love being with you, and I can't <clears throat> ignore the fact that, you know, there's something here. No. How do I know that this time I can really trust you? Well, all I can give you is my word. I think that if you and I give this a shot, we really have to give it 100%. I mean, no lying. We have to be very honest with each other and, and really try. Otherwise, it's not going to work, I don't think. Then I'm willing to give it a shot. If you are. Season 10. Thank you. Oh, my God. This is a I'm happy. Me too. So what now? Are you my boyfriend? It's a stacked question. No, dog, that's when you say yes. yes. So doing this to us. I was not expecting that. Oh, Thank God he's wearing a shirt at this time. <laughs> We got no Ooh, next on. We need those links to work. We got no next on. That's frustrating. And we don't know if it's, uh, do we think that was the season finale? I don't know. Oh. 
All right, well, thanks for being here. <laughs> We're gonna do another one. I'm gonna be in a mood for it, so get ready, everyone. Are you sure you wanna do it? Positive. Okay. 